Hello again folks and welcome back to Let's Play Elden Ring. I am your DM, Darius, and last we left off, I had done just a smidgen of grinding. Uh, kind of reallocated a little bit of my, um, spells. And I actually had discovered something of a new, new place that I can grind. And it's actually relatively easy. Uh, and I'm going to go this way anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I found. See, the pre the previous way that I was grinding was by going to the bridge that leads to uh, the Divine Tower pretty much just after Godfrey. And this one is actually pretty simple. And a lot more simpler than I imagined it was going to be. And uh, I have relatively low runes right now so you can actually you know see how fast this will get you some runes and uh, I've done this several times so I'm getting used to it and let this guy Cal get up a little bit so that you can actually sneak attack her these guys up here are pretty much the biggest boom because they exploded in lightning. In such a brilliant way that it kind of destroys each and every single one of the. Well, oh, oh, nope. Roll away, roll away. Now, unfortunately, they are the sort that if you're not careful, they will immediately. You know, surround you and whatnot. Yeah, right there. Just nearly a cool 7,000. You can go into there and get another 2,000. I usually don't like to because those ones are the shieldy ones. So I'm going to pop plop down. Also, I did miss that there was this in here. Don't need to do this, but there was a smithing stone seven in here. Yeah, this is far easier than the bridge towards the divine tower. Now remember creepy slime ball here? I go ahead and destroy him because I mean that's another like nine hundred. Oh, oh. He getting tricky. Getting tricky. Yeah, if you have the right weapon, you can pretty much instantly combo him to death. And no, they do not constantly drop the thing you need to respec, sadly enough. Now, this next part is kind of dependent on how patient you are. Because there's the giant ball up there, but he will constantly drop more and more slimes. And again, with each slime being like 540, I think. Now, he does have a maximum amount that he drops before he himself drops down. So, it's really just dependent on how confident you are in your own slime drop. Uh, slime slaying skills, as it were. I think he's near. Dropped all of them. All I know is that when he drops a certain amount, then it will drop down. And uh, the funny part is, is that he'll drop down, but then he'll run away to the far corner of the room leaving his little youngins to deal with ya. Oh, no. That's the first time i actually seen him try to roll towards me. But yeah. And again, the lightning ones will lightning ones will uh, explode brilliantly. Thus, slaying all the other ones around it. 
And if there's more than one lightning guy, it's just a chain reaction. It's pretty neat. Look at that. 21 and some change runes. That's some niceness. Now you can also go up here uh, and get like an additional 4k and some change because of the silver, the silver tier mimics. But unfortunately I constantly have problems with these guys, mostly because of the tower shield guy. So usually I would try to sneak around doing the priestess lady and then just uh, run over there, hope that I can take on the dudes one by one. I ain't gonna do that right now though, I don't feel like it, uh, mostly because I had discovered this pathway and I wanted to see what was what is this way I had gone down and saw that there were some ants but other than that it's a uh, it's a mystery wrapped in a riddle inside of an enigma but yeah with that run I could feasibly get enough runes for a level up in like 10 minutes ish there was a golden seed I picked that up I do not have enough yeah I still need a third one yeah I didn't explore too much this way because I saw the giant ants and then just remembering ants and then there's this over here don't know where that goes, but I hear hear something. So I just want to stay a little bit cautious around the ants because uh, I seem to recall them kicking my ass something fierce. And again, these guys are pretty nice XP. I am powerful enough, by the way, to do to use this staff, the one from what's her face. I went ahead and went to the um, thing to get it remade. That uh, shrine place worth it if you ask me especially since I believe I'm going to be using a bit more spell casting than I have been bit like a dunce. Have I already been this way before? No. No, I haven't because I would remember. Yeah, there if this was the way I think it thought it was, then there would be a shrunk like a bunch of ruins over there. Let's go down or up. Oh hi. They had seen me. <laughs> I had been perceived. And how much more further down can this... Well, that question's already been answered. Have I been down this way? I guess I have. Huh. Did not recall that. How the hell did I forget that? I don't know. 
didn't expect death. Yep, and this way leads towards the rock area. Well, shoot. Feels like I just wasted a little bit of time with that exploration, but I did get a golden seed, so. And hey, I, sh I showed you guys um, something of a something of a uh, grinding trick, so hey. Which, admittedly, I'll probably get to doing more of myself later on. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 okay. Keep on forgetting the things I found. I had found... Uh, these Kaled Catacombs that I was just walking around and trying to explore some stuff in this time I will be able to do that I don't know what's down here <laughs> legit had found the place was all like oh hey catacombs you suck Yep. Just, yep. Gonna be one of those places, ain't it? How filled with rot is this place, anyways? I mean, I already don't like it simply because of the rot. The skeletons don't make it any better. Ew, 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 ew. There's more rot? Yes, it is. Well, at the least it's a little bit lenient in... Oh, alright. Do I have to destroy you? I feel like I have to destroy them. And Scarlet Rot. Alright, cool. And before anyone asks, no, I do not have what it takes to make more of the anti Scarlet, -scarlet Rot stuff. Otherwise, I would make it. I don't know what I'm worried about. Already got the Scarlet Ron. All right, so oh, under passage. You son of a gun. Miranda Spout Ashes. Oh no, is this place gonna be chock full of secret bits that are? hidden in the rod areas. I mean, my my health is actually going down far slower than it used to with the other Scarlet Rod area. Good miss, Dar. Yeah, I feel like that this area is going to be filled with little secret areas now that I've only had one. Uh, it's fine. We're fine. It's fine. Rock totally doesn't just suck. I have already pushed myself in that direction. Eh, 
this seriously the only? Heck. Poison bloom. No. Damn it. Fear. Okay, I mostly just have fear for this godforsaken. That shit. At least, though, if I die over here, I can die right next to the. Why is my rock building up still? It didn't pass ahead, then time for lever. Where, oh, where would that hidden path be? Oh, where, oh, where could it go? Ah, this statue's got the arms. Lever had therefore try attack. Oh. So the part of the Souls community that's not a giant case of trolls, I thank you. Alright, this looks like a situation where I'm going to die, because I only have the one flask remaining. But at least there's a statue. Cry holy, ill-omened creature. Oh, it's you again! Hi! Ow, 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 ow. Um, that's new. Kindred of Rotted Ashes. Okay, it was nowhere near as bad as I thought it was going to be. I'll give it that. But then again, I did fight that thing before. It just didn't have that little pustule thing that it shoots you with. Eh. Yeah. Rest at the site. Uh, oh yeah. I did just get a new, I guess, companion of sorts. Where are you? This one. Uh, some of the, the spirit of the kindred of rot. Oh, the inside guys. The spirit takes the form of a crawling pest. It's chitinous body making a dry rustling sound. It attacks enemies by secreting sticky threads. The kindred of rot are the servants of the goddess of rot. Servants that have been forsaken. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, and fun fact, in order to get to this place, more or less, I had to fight that. It was actually a pretty intense, if not a little bit fun fight. Not worth the, um, the runes you get for it, though. Hello, Ryder. Goodbye, writer. So, uh, I guess... Now it's mostly just a matter of trying to run around the place and see what I find. Because there's a Durgan somewhere around here, too. And while his rock breath effect doesn't kill me, his rot breath kills me. Oh, hello. Sir, if I'm gonna fight you, it's gonna be out here in the open.
Ooh. Smithing stone, beast blood, two old fangs. Oh, that's where I got the old fangs. Okay. More beast's blood. Should be walking around with my shield more. More beast blood. Oh, times three. Anything up here? Oh, that looks up. That looks over the uh, desert. God, I hate how squishy this place sounds. I don't know. It's just something about. And it's it's. It's the squish, but it's also knowledge of what the squish is comprised of, you know? Like, it could be just a muddy squish, and it's like, oh, okay, it's it's fine, it's mud, we know it's mud. But this is like a weird fungal rot thing. I did not just alert. Okay. To be fair, this is actually a really... Whew. Okay, maybe those guys weren't really still not worth the fight, but still. <laughs> those are a lot harder to fight on even grounding because they will peck you. And the pecking sucks. And it suddenly comes out of nowhere, as does its little uh, dive down on you. Oh, is that a... Ooh, this feels like a trap. Yup. There's a big bird. Alright. Now you guys get to see a relatively fair fight with one of these things. Crystal tear. Windy, 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 windy. Enhances dodge rolls for time in mixed physics. Sultan concoction, effectiveness of dodge rolls. However, damage taken is also increased during the concoction's effect. I mean, I know that the whole point of dodge rolling is to completely, you know, say F you to the damage altogether, but. Hot damn. Can't help but feel like that's not worth it. Especially with my own personal uh, dodging skills of non existent. Let's see. I wonder if I should try to go at that. Have I gone to that castle over there before? I don't think so. Oh, of note, too. God damn it, I keep on forgetting things I... What? Uh... I hope I'm not the only one that saw that. So, of note, too, I had been exploring... Oh, jeez. The lake area there. Pretty interesting area. I found a place where there was a, like a bunch of spirits. Cool. Stop by the shack. Okay. And uh, one of these spirits was a giant knight. It, it was like one of those trolls, but a knight. And was pretty neat. I fought him, and I got a I got the troll swords, troll knight sword, plus one. 
God, I hate those things. I don't know, they're just creepy. Sue me. Alright, stop by the shack. Hi. Oh, a pleasure to see you. A pleasure indeed. I am Gary, a great sage. In my day, anyway. I'd hoped to ask a favor when one of your ilk came along. A strapping young tarnished, able to cross the Scarlet Swamp of Aeonia. Don't fret, I'll provide fine recompense. Should you accept, I will teach you the secret of Celia, the town you see there. Alright, I'll hear you out. Ah, then you are willing to lend a hand, are you? I need your help to heal a certain young girl. Her name is Millicent. You will find her beyond Celia, resting at the church atop the cliff, stricken by the rotting sickness. I really don't have a way to cure that. The rotting sickness that afflicts Millicent has no cure. Oh. When the Erd Tree flourished, even the demigods could not stave off its effects, despite their nigh godhood. But Millicent's suffering can be ameliorated. For this, you are to find a certain needle. Seek the deep, scarlet swamp of Aeonia outside Celia's bounds. The needle, made from unalloyed gold, is lost somewhere there. Wait, did I find that already? First, you must find it's hidden, then I will the secret. I guess I didn't. Don't mind me crouching, sir. I'm just hiding from your guard dog. Okay. So Millicent is in there? Or am I in relation to everything? Oh, I had been into the town of sorcery before. Alright, um... Wants me to go into the Aeolian Swamp Shore. Let's try to go into the Aeolian Swamp. Oh. Huh. Don't recall that spirit being there before. Mmm. I'm seeing why I never went into the swamp. What's up? Let me see it, if only one last time. A splendid blade dancing among the rock, scarlet rocks. Oh, he's probably talking about, um... What's his face? Douche canoe. Ugh. So, I have a theory about those... The random skulls that have runes in them. I don't know if I've shared this before. It, it's been so many episodes, man. Um, but I think that they are players that died and af invaded. What? I was invaded by Millicent. Woo! Okay. Okay. All right. That's new. Never been invaded in a swamp area before, but okay. That's a lie. <laughs> that is a falsehood. As I suddenly remember, Demon Souls was a thing. Alright. Uh, is that gonna be a constant thing? Her invading me? Also, I'm trying to help you. So if you could not. Oh, wait, maybe it's one of those things where she thinks I'm doing a bad.
I'd have blocked more, but I really didn't see a good opportunity to do so. Alright, where are you, Millicent? We only have so much fighting grounds. Oh, there you are. You're not going to be affected by the rod, are you? Why would you? Oh, that's hardly fair. Ah, <sighs> sir. Oh, this ain't bullshit. I don't know what you're talking about. What? Oh. I don't even know who you are, sir. Oh. That's a cool skill. Clean Rot Knight's Sword. That's not a sword, thank you very much. Uh, I should probably just run back and... I don't know. <laughs> I gotta admit, I really love the uh, the effect the sword has on people when you slap them with him. It's kind of like a giant blue sword bitch slap. The way they just kind of go, ugh, ugh, ugh. I don't think I found a recipe for using the alien butterflies. Oh. Oh. Oh, this hardly seems fair. Yep. Well, aren't you pretty boss looking? At least there's a statue nearby. Actually, wait, how nearby is the statue? Will I be standing inside some rock? I'll be standing by some rock. Okay. Let the wolves come out. Whoa. Ow. What? Oh, that is cheap ass shit. You know it, sir. Shit. Ah. Now the question lies, how much is, how much of a chance do I have now that I have Scarlet Rock? <sighs> oh, 
Holy zip. I was trying to kill the soldier. Alright, so I think all of his attacks do Scarlet Rot. Just don't do something like summoning up more allies. That shit's cheap. Oh, come on. I knew he was going to. I don't know why I bothered commenting on it. I could... I'm trying to think how I can do this. Because I do have my staff. The only spell I got prepared is Gravity Well, though. I don't think it's going to be that effective against the general. Shit. Shit. Sir, you've already summoned up hacking troops against me. I forget it's these exile knights too. Yeah, that does next to nothing against him. I think it's something like the, um... I think it's something like one of the fights I had in Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles with Mel. I didn't need to heal there. Watch out, pups. Phase 2 is going to start soon. Shit. I can never seem to dodge that one. Sure. Okay, come on. Okay. An alloyed gold needle. 
Ah, uh, this place sucks. <laughs> Just unabashedly, it sucks. Do I have enough for a level up? Yeah, I better use that while I have it. The damage is getting up there. I didn't think it was... Oh, for love of... <sighs> Alright. So... Uh, now the question lies, is Torrent affected by the rod? Or can I be lucky enough? And he is not. Oh, he's not affected. Wow, that would have made things a lot easier there, darn, wouldn't it? Yep. It certainly would have. Why am I heading south? I'm heading south because it's the way I need to go. To get back to this gallery guy. I'll need to jump off in just a hot second, though, because I'm from hell. Oh, don't you worry, Mr. Troll. You'll get yours in some time. As far as I've noticed, too, uh, when these T-Rex dogs do die, they do come back, so not really worth it to try to kill them. Oh, you found the unalloyed gold needle. As promised, I've detailed the secret of Celia right here. Go on, it's yours. Now let me have a look at the needle. Hmm. Hmm. Well, well, this is a marvel indeed. The work of a true artisan, a meticulous, bold craftsman who grasps the essence of life. Can you give me some time with this? As well made as it is, it won't be much use snapped in half, will it? Look, I did what I can, man. Oh, secrets, eh? Note given by Sage Gallery detailing the secret he promised. The town of Celia hides the source, light three flames atop the candle towers to break the seal. I probably would have ended up doing that anyways. <laughs> I won't lie. But honestly, that the fight with the general, I I was claiming bullshit in the middle of it, but actually that was It was a pretty fun fight, I won't lie. I know, sometimes, sometimes add-ons can really make a fight, and that was definitely one of those times where if it weren't for the add-ons, there probably would not have been much of a challenge. Hmm. I just want to look around here a little bit, just in case he's... Yeah, let's activate the summoning pool. Ooh, glintstone flies. Be wary of invisible sort and then be- oh no, invisible mage shit. That's right. That's right, I remember you now. Alright, we're gonna step out right over here for a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode here. When do we return? Uh, I'm going to actually explore this town. Much to my chagrin, simply because I hate the invisible mages. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.